closer to you. I am supposed to be the pioneer in hydroponics in India. I learned this technology in Australia and brought this technology to India considering that it is very much required in our kind of environment. To address the uh, issue of food security and growing great vegetables without the use of pesticides, I started this project. It's called the Pate Burrow Project. I fell in love with this technology and I said, wow, this is a great way to grow vegetables which are highly nutritious and without much use of pesticides and uh, the best part being that we don't really have to worry about soil fertility and various other things and the most beautiful thing about this technology that fascinated me was that it's more like a plant factory you grow plants as if you're growing them on an assembly line viability is based upon what kind of a crop would you choose to grow and the decision to grow a particular crop will be based upon a market study. If you were to produce those kind of exotic tomatoes or cucumbers or bell peppers or capsicum, definitely there's a market. It's all about climate control. If you're able to do the right climate control and uh, the nutritional control, you can grow virtually any kind of vegetable. One should not just get into it uh, from an opportunism kind of an angle, but they should look at it as an opportunity. If they look at it as an opportunity and are ready to play in the long term and also develop the skills needed, then there is no question of not being a successful farmer using hydroponic technology. There is so much space on the rooftop that is absolutely unused and uh, most of the cities in the future will be getting most of their horticultural uh, produce from within the cities itself. So there is a huge amount of potential and benefits that can ensue by trying to do hydroponics on rooftops. It's been a very good experience. It's been an experience of a lot of trust and faith and a lot of passion. Everything matches up with the kind of passion that I have. So my experience so far with Future Farms and in the coming future, I know is going to be excellent. I can only ask everyone to start with a Darwin or a hobby kits at home, if nothing else to start learning. And the most beautiful thing I could, can tell of the audience here is, if you want to really start learning at a very basic level, Future Farms has everything that you need. I implore everybody to try this at home and grow something or the other. Because today we know that uh, we have a lot of pesticides in our uh, food that we eat. I would only tell the audience to join the gang and create a hydroponics revolution in this country.